Ah, uh, Johan, just let me remember. Did you hear from this Avid consoles? Which one? No, this Avid consoles, this, this, this uh, sound consoles, they just have this bigger mouse mm -hmm. inside. Mm -hmm. Really? Yeah, that's, that every faders just move automatically and all wow. the LEDs are blinking and flashing and it's bigger small. Wow, I think it will be wonderful if we put that in our console. Instead of the granny mail? Yes. Yeah, that could be a nice, that idea. Could be a nice idea. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. Let's go. I will program all faders so that they change the colors when they are moving. This should look good, especially with the Grand May 3, as it has all these nice backlit faders. In the second step, I will program that the fader automatically run. Together, that would be a nice start for a Vegas show file. Anyone who has already recreated my tutorial Q-Step Fader is probably already in possession of the fixture type Q-Step Fader. I also need that for the Vegas Fader. I'll show you how to do that again. First, you have to create your own fixture. To do this, I go to the section Patch in the new Setup and click on Fixture Types. Here I click on Add to create a new fixture. I give a name and a short name. Then I click Edit to set individual attributes. I need a dimmer and 10 dummy channels. These 10 channels will later control the individual cues of my sequence. The dimmer is virtual. So, the dummies are mapped to the DMX channels and then connected to the dimmer. Default must be set to 100 here. Then I leave the area again and go to the DMX profiles. I need 10 DMX profiles and I will label them step 1 through step 10. To edit a DMX profile, I have to select it and then click to edit. I can add, edit and remove points here. I click table mode and then decimal to enter values directly. I now define individual areas for the DMX output of each profile. I go back to Fixture Types, choose my fixture and click Edit again. Here I connect now the created DMX profiles with my fixture. I leave the area of Fixture Types and patch 15 Q-Step Fader on the Universe 1. I now save the individual fixtures with 100% intensity on the first 15 faders of my grandma.
in the DMX sheet, I can now see very well how the individual faders outputs the DMX values. In the Setup, Remote Input, DMX Input section, I now connect the DMX channels with the remote inputs. I create 10 new inputs. These react to the DMX channels 1.1 to 1.10 and should execute a specific command. In the line Command, I will give the command for changing the color of Executor 1.1. As you can imagine, the letters R, G and B stand for the color value that the executor should assume. Works very well. I now delete the programmer and enlarge the faders view that we see more of this. And now the hard work follows. For each individual dimmer channel, a DMX remote input must be definite. With 15 fixtures and 10 DMX channels per fixture, there are 150 DMX remote inputs. Have a lot of fun with that! It's a lot of work, but the result is impressive. There is also a way to export the DMX remotes to a file, then edit it on the computer and later import that. Find yourself. Now, all executors are changing their colors. I'm going over to the next part for automation the faders. I go back to the patch menu and pitch. 15 ordinary demo channels to the universe 2. From here, I go directly to the DMX remotes and put on 15 more remote inputs. This will be now connected to the Universe 2 and are supposed to control the executors on page 1.
back to my fader page. With the dimmer channels, I can now move my faders. I save a sequence with three steps. With the command assign temp temp, I can make the button directly to a toggle. Of course, I can now also select and save every effect. Now the challenge is opened. I would be very happy if I could see some nice Vegas Modi. Post your results just under the hashtag MAVegasMode or only Vegas Mode. This was a video from Feeds.de. My name is Feeds and I thank you for watching. Just for fun, write the command debug p in your command line.